Today we'll be making the Sturmgeschütz 3 or the Stug 3. The Stug 3 was a German assault gun or a tank used in World War II. And surprisingly, it was the most produced German assault gun or a tank used in World War II. This tank was requested by Wolf Fram 01 and Red Team Killer 12. So thank you for requesting the tank. Many people wanted the Stug 3, so here you are. Anyways, let's get into the tutorial. For starters, here's a reference image. To make the hull of the tank, I cut out a long strip of cardboard the thickness of the hull. Then I started cutting out pieces and gluing them on together according to the tank's shape. This slant I'm adding right here is this part of the tank. The gun and other parts will be added on later. And the slanting piece of cardboard is a little lengthier because I have to account for the tracks. The top piece of the tank is folded because it's a little bent as seen here. To make the side of the tank, I just glued on a whole piece of cardboard onto the side and trimmed it out. I only made the sides of the tank below the top piece here, because the place where the gun is held is a lot lengthier than the hole. When you're done, it should look like this weird looking car. I added on the track coverings, which was this long strip of cardboard. The gun piece is glued on and it's made by using broken pencils. The casted part of the gun is molded using hot glue. Then I started building on these frontal parts and adding vision slits. After that was made, I glued on the wheels. The wheels are just foam board that is cut out into circles. When that was done, I started adding details. This includes hatches, cupolas, and anything else on the tank.
When I'm done adding details, it should look something like this. The final step is to paint the whole entire tank. I painted my tank a dark gray and the tracks are just black. I also paint on the iron cross for added detail. And after all that, you can add on the tracks, and now you're basically done. So, thank you for requesting the Stug 3. A lot of people really wanted it and I'm glad that I made it. The next how to video will probably be the Trich Hill or the Martyr 2 so yeah. Anyways thank you all for watching.